Welcome back everybody, this is uh, our uh, fourth replay commented uh, for Dawn of War 2 Retribution and the new for tonight is that, as uh, you can hear, I'm trying to cast in English tonight to to make also foreign people to, to understand what uh, uh, what I say when I comment the, the replay of Dawn of War. And uh, as everyone can, uh, I think, immediately perceive English is not my natural language so I'm a little bit shy about this but this is an experiment and in the end I I hope to be understandable to, to everyone and not to sound too ridiculous uh, can I say so my plan for tonight was to uh, to cast um, a replay of uh, Maniac playing in uh, one versus one against a um, very skilled player, but unfortunately, uh, just tonight or I think yesterday, uh, the new patch for the game has been applied. So uh, all of my replays, and I think also all of your replays, the replays of everyone, has become not compatible, not compatible with the with the game. So you can only um, load the, the replays, you save it after the, the patch application. So, I just have one, it's a, it's a good game, however, and uh, it's a game I played uh, yesterday night with uh, Theo, Warfling Theo, and uh, Maniac as my ally, is a 3 versus 3 a team battle, and um, we did pretty well, we win in the end. Um, against three random player three player the matchmaking uh, the matchmaker as uh, um, as uh, put against us and uh, we were two space marine and one chaos marine as you can see in uh, typhoon arena is the map and uh, I don't know exactly why but uh, when we play in this in this map I usually mm, I usually play in the position um, that have to uh, to deal with the, with the northern map of the main, the one with the with the circle in the upper right corner in this uh, in this diagram. Uh, in uh, in this game, I was in uh, position number four, while uh, my allies in position number five and six has took care of the left corner of the map. I think this particular uh, match we played is very interesting. Um, in terms of uh, coordinated movement, uh, you know, the 3 versus 3 is uh, in the end uh, all about uh, coordination with your teammates because uh, being in 2 versus 1, uh, I mean, uh, being able to coordinate an attack of 2 of you versus 1 of your opponents, it's a sort of guarantee of success in that particular. Uh, engagement. So, the more you are able to coordinate your team to hit and strike the other team, the more are uh, the, your chances to win. And in this particular match, as far as I remember, because I played yesterday in the late night with my friends and allies, we were uh, almost uh, stuck in a position. The, the enemy w were very well entrenched in. Uh, uh, in a favorable position and uh, we are very low on points until we did a sort of a crazy and uncoordinated movement uh, around the map that, uh, how can I say, uh, changed the, the tides of the battle as the uh, force commanders say because the enemies has been forced to uh, replan the defenses and uh, they were not able to to cope with our uh, our um, spearhead uh, pushing in the south and uh, they in the end lo lost uh, also the north. In this map usually uh, this is a symmetrical map so usually um, people in position 2 and 3 and 5 and 6 struggle for the control of the center of the map and the south where we have uh, one victory point uh, at the very same distance from the two bases and uh, the, the most of the energy of the map we have two energy points per side very important it is also the Nord in, uh, in the recent matches we played in this map I usually uh, 
when, when I play in the position uh, coping with the north, of course. Um, in position 1 and 4, I usually send my scouts as a first order when the when the game begins in the in the powerpoint so uh i can uh, hopefully uh, ensure my capturing of this point before the opponent comes i don't know if this is in the end a, a good move but uh, i've been lacking uh, till now so i will uh, continue to apply this kind of tactics okay so here we go In the in this uh, side of the map, as uh, I was saying, there um, there are me with the uh, with the apothecary, the usual apothecary, and uh, Theo, Wolfling Theo, um, with the uh, um, Space Marine Force Commander, and the and the maniac with the Plague with Champions. On the other side, we have an apothecary, uh, war boss, and a Lord General. Uh, just a note, if you are wondering just in case what uh, "pent" in front of our name means uh, is just an Italian abbreviation for for the word uh, "pantofola." Uh, it means uh, um, slipper. Um, it's a name of a sort of a clan we are trying to find, but <laughs> it's a small thing. It's just about uh, uh, three of us, three three friends in the in the real life. Uh, <laughs> we are. Uh, enjoying doing uh, these kind of uh, childish things. So, uh, here we go. Let's see where would be the first engagement of uh, of this uh, uh, of this match. As far as I remember, I I lost uh, very badly the engagement with my opponent. Uh, that was uh, the apothecary. So a very mirror match. Uh, let's just see my opponent. Uh, uh, preferred to capture first the requisition point and then the victory point as, well, as I was anticipating. I'm uh, pointing directly to the power point in the center before everything else and the requisition with my hero. Let's just see what's our, what my allies were doing. Uh, standard power capturing as, as also in the other side. And the Imperial Guard is already on the victory point down there, coping with uh, some Space Marine and uh, some uh, Retics. Where the hero is, the Plague Champion is down there. Very high damage dealt from Maniac uh, to the Retics. Maniac is a very skilled player, and uh, as far as I know, uh, Chaos is the. Um, is the, the side he plays the best um, is his preferred is the preferred army and um, just a note for everything out there uh, Maniac got uh, his stats resetted some days ago so if you meet him in uh, in a match on uh, on Steam you can uh, see that uh, he have uh, around um, 1200 uh, 1300 1300 uh, uh, ranking so uh, is not his uh, real ranking. is about uh, over 2,000 ranking. So don't be don't be desperate if you <laughs> if you if you are slayed by a 100 2,000 uh, ranked player because he's not so so low. So we see our my first engagement with the other apothecary as well as I was anticipating. Uh, not very good. I'm risking to lose my hero. No, uh, sorry, guys. Uh, was not mine. My, we are in uh, in red. So, however, uh, <laughs> both of the apothecary goes down. So it made no no a great difference. But uh, my team is red. I'm used to see. I'm used to see my team in, in green. So I I, I was uh, um, I was speaking incorrectly. So Maniac is keep pushing, but the point is still in the end of uh, our opponents, and I did not capture this victory point, and also, uh, and uh, we have uh, Victaurus, our opponent is uh, is capturing both of the apothecary still down here, and uh, here I come with my 
yellow and blue army trying to uh, to push back Victarus. He did not capture the point, but uh, the one on the left still in the hand of our enemies. Here the cows approaching, capturing the point with the aid of uh, of Theo, Wolfing Theo. So we are in a good position in uh, the south, but uh, also in the north we captured the point we, we lost, but uh, this is another engagement to tactical uh, squad of mine against uh, scout and another tactical, but unfortunately a devastator comes and also the war boss in support, so I have to retreat to avoid any further losses, I already got some losses and uh, I'm suffering uh, very much of attrition in uh, in this first encountering. So retreating, reorganizing uh, an assault uh, squad uh, comes out for my for my army. In the meanwhile, in the middle, we are uncapturing a requisition point on the symmetry line, so a very contested one. The victory point is still in our hands, but uh, the total point is 460 for our enemies against 320 for for us. Here we have the Plague with Champion forced to retreat. Uh, not a problem for me, we will survive. Let's just take a look at the power situation. We have a fully powered, uh, fully upgraded power farm here and uh, our opponents doesn't have a fully upgraded power farm here they have just one generator here we have uh, Theo dealing with some uh, orcs while uh, in the upper part I am dealing with the whole army of the Victaurus Bacaser and no way I have to retreat once again to to avoid to, to lose my army. My assault got um, almost killed by the two tacticals and my two tacticals at this point is a very um, numerical inferiority against the, the army and uh, I have to, to retreat. So our opponents in this moment have uh, all three of the points because also in the south this, uh, this assault is a uh, successful assault uh, made by uh, orcs and uh, I think we have just orcs here but is enough. Orcs and uh, Imperial Guard of course, sorry, wasn't see correctly. So we have Space Marine entrenched here with also Devastator waiting for me uh, with our natural victory point in hand their natural victory point is in their hand and the south point also in their hand so we are at 200 point uh, going down very quickly because we have 